I am on week eight <laughs> of my dopey training. Mm. I also got some new running shoes several weeks ago and I'm gonna share them with you guys because they're great. And so if you're getting into running or have been running and need any shoe advice, I love these. It is foggy and cloudy out today. By the way, these are the shoes. Hoka, this is them. Am I saying that right, Hoka? I don't know, but they're amazing for running and I think that they're great. So I got them at Dick's Sporting Goods. Um, anyways, my training has been going really well. Um, I've been keeping up with every day. I've only missed one day so far and that was like back at like week two or something. And that's because I was having um, some pain in my, I think it was my shin. I don't know. Um, but that's the only day I missed. I've hit every other day. So this week I'm following the Jeff Galloway training program. So this week, um, I have a 45 minute run today, 45 minute run on Thursday and a nine mile run on Saturday, but it shouldn't be so bad. So yeah, I just got to run 45 minutes today and, um, I'm just doing, I'm walking at the beginning. I like to do like a warm up before I just start running, uh, cause I don't want to injure myself. That's important. By the way, I don't wear this for sweat reasons. I wear this because... I use my AirPods to listen to music and these things just bounce out when I run. So it kind of keeps them in. I think they have a thing like where you can put it behind your head, um, which I want to get because this is annoying because I have to wash every time because it gets sweaty. Um, but that's why I have this thing. I am only 12 minutes into my run and they've just recently built this new path. And I love it because it goes through neighborhoods and then it like goes through the woods. I don't have to worry about stopping for cars and stuff and it's kind of quiet other than me out here vlogging okay i stopped to walk just for this part okay other than the giant power lines there this is a really i just love walking through this area because it's just there's no houses this is as far as i've ever been because you see this built this giant bridge right here there's a giant gap there because they haven't finished it so i run out here every week Hoping that one week, I know eventually it will be finished and I'll finally get to go across the bridge. I could just walk down there because it's just dirt and stuff, but um, it rained and so it's all muggy. And uh, I'm not gonna do that to my shoes. Okay, anyways, back to running. I've stopped now like three times to record, but luckily it's just been for a few seconds. I like to keep it consistent running without stopping, but you guys are worth stopping. I think I'm about 20 minutes into my 45 minute run so far. Ah, peaceful. Okay, my run is done. My average pace was 9 to 45, which ended up being 4.63 miles, which is very on average and what I normally do. Nine something is very average per mile for me, but I've only been running for almost two years. This August will be two years. And I remember when I started running, my average pace was like 12 or 13 minutes per mile. So I've really, I know some people out there can run much faster than nine minutes per mile, but for me, that's a great accomplishment. Um, anyways, I am vlogging, so I need to set my phone down and then run past it like I didn't set my phone down for a thumbnail. Okay, I think this might be a good thumbnail area. <laughs> Hopefully that makes a good thumbnail. Yeah, okay, I rewatched it. It's a good enough thumbnail. All right, well, that's my update for my uh, Dopey Run Disney challenge, and I will update you guys soon. Goodbye.